Today's show is sponsored by ExpressVPN. One-click protection for all your devices. Securing yourself couldn't be easier. Visit expressvpn.com slash funhouse. Hello, and welcome to the Funhouse podcast. Today, episode number. Episode April 13th, 2021. That's today's day. Uh, just a regular podcast, same as any other over the last year. Mm-hmm. No difference. But we're in this place. But but Ryan's here, so that's Ryan, different. I'm normally not a here. guest on the show. I've never, this is my second appearance on the Funhouse podcast. And really? Jacob's here, and he's usually not here. I'm usually not here unless we're talking about Star Wars, which is that's like once true. every six months. <laughs> and mm. James is here, and that's so unusual. So I, mm. um, And we're here. We're on the set that I think we've heard a lot of complaints about. The comfort, mm-hmm. yeah, whatever. The I, don't, I feel good. Listen, good on my butt. I've been doing this so long. I used to hear complaints about the set. Okay, <laughs> so we'll see if everyone who complained about the not set comes back now. We'll see. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> we spent the last year sitting in like a really comfortable office chair. So yeah. this is this is a, like wakes oh me up God. a little bit. This my is all right. I twisted feel... spine already yeah. twisted by this thing. If they if they ever cut away to me in in V mix or whatever, I would just be like, Yeah, he's too comfortable. That's why yeah. we put him in. The they got to snap at me, wake yeah. me up before I get back in the scene. So it's us here, and Omar's here too, holding it down in the little back room. Is he gonna show himself? You show yourself. That's there what he I'm is. saying. There he is. Omar's here. Uh, and, you know, Studio, our little... we're doing it. <laughs> Yeehaw. Yeah, hell yeah. <laughs> um, so uh, thanks, guys, for coming all the way here. We all took our test. I think a lot of us are in the process of getting our vaccinations mm-hmm. fully completed, but we're still taking the proper precautions, and I know that we're going to continue to take those precautions for as long as it's necessary to keep everybody safe. Ryan, you want to drink of my water? Uh, is that a test? Say no. That was no. a test, Ryan. No. Come on. I have my own. Good here. on you, Ryan. Yeah. Good you on go. you. I'm only one of two vaccinated. So <laughs> yeah, me too. I can't do that yet. <laughs> so, Ryan, uh, yesterday or earlier today, you mentioned to me that you're going to see a movie tonight. I am. My reunion Ooh, cinema for the starts first time. tonight. I can't wait. Which brought me to uh, read some sad news yesterday about the ArcLight and Pacific yeah. Theaters mm-hmm. closing. Mm. All their locations. Yeah. Just in time. <laughs> this is a very West Coast thing. It that, is. Yeah. But it's a bit, yeah, it's a big thing for this city, for sure, right? Because yeah. it includes the Cinerama uh, Dome. Yeah. And I have it. And going to buy it. We all know that. I feel like somebody's going to save it, right? But still, it was very sad. It was everybody was sad on yeah, social media. I, already, I yeah. was not sad. I would like to. Th- I know you oh, posted okay. a very. Ang- you couldn't wait to see, see it go. Of it. I have some pictures. The, the people. Yeah, can we the show a picture show. of the Cinerama Dome? So it's the Cinerama Dome is the largest uh, round screen. Is. Ever. Yeah, mm-hmm. I've only seen, I think, one oh. movie there. Oh, that's perfect. Hi. Um, I've only seen one movie there. Um, really? And it was a mediocre experience. <laughs> I saw one movie there as well. I was going to ask everybody if you'd seen a movie there. I've seen what it was. countless movies there. and I In the it, dome? In the dome, yeah. Mm-hmm. And I will say, I it is bizarre because it's the weirdest movie theater. It's mm-hmm. weird. Because it is about more than half the time I hate it. In a weird way, yeah, like, yeah. Like it, there's, there's like so, so basically, it, it's unlike other theaters where there, you're sitting here. There's a screen in front of you. It's more like you're kind of like it's looking. It's like planetarium. Like, at it. It's like a yeah. It's like a pan- planetarium. I've never been to the screen. theater, but so it's really good for some movies that are mm-hmm. big movies. Yeah. But there are only like 15 seats in the whole theater <laughs> that are actually good. That's what that was my big point <laughs> is that unless you're in the exact center in yeah. the, kind of the back, it is perfect with, with there. Whenever, yeah, whenever yeah. I can score that seat, I do love it then. But it's like VR, I'm in the I'm usually in the middle or the front, yeah, uh, the front middle or the side middle, and then it sucks. Man. Yeah. That's what was weird. the movie that you saw there? The one I movie. Remember. I remember. You don't remember your one experience. No, because in the it cinema. wasn't good. <laughs> it wasn't good, and I. I remember I was like waiting and I must it would have been a midnight premiere of something and I was like all right here we go and I got in, I was like this looks yeah. great yeah what was I your s- big movie there Ryan the the one I remember liking the most where I was in the perfect seat was the master because it was like the 70 millimeter you okay. know like, yeah, like yeah. if you're gonna see this a 70 millimeter movie it's uh-huh. a Cinerama dome yeah perfect classic place to see it but uh, so that was the best one, mm-hmm. I and, and and I don't really even love that movie. To be honest. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's okay. Yeah, yeah, it's like whatever. I went in two thousand eight, and I saw The Dark Knight. 
Oh, okay. Mm-hmm. Well, there you go. Yeah. But so I actually went to film school across the street from the cinema. The Los Angeles Ooh. Film, the Los Los Angeles Los Angeles film the Academy. The Los Angeles oh, Film Academy. Los Angeles Film School. $60,000 in debt. Oh. For one year. Mm-hmm. Um, That's like two screenings of the cinema. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so I had seen a lot of movies in those theaters like that are just part of the complex, but I only saw one in the dome. Yeah. There's like t- I put another cool picture on the, the slide. The big thing about it is it's, it's part of Hollywood history, right? Ooh, like nighttime. It's, it's still the largest uh, theater of its kind, and I think it is the, correct me if I'm wrong, I think it's the, like, most profitable theater or something the like Hollywood that. Hollywood Arclight is the most profitable. Yeah. Yeah. Um, single theater. And, in and just Perfect in terms expensive. of construction, it's, I guess, the largest uh, concrete dome on the planet <laughs> or something like that. <laughs> oh, there's really? so, something, there's something about it that's, that, that's very unique, but, uh, and it, yeah, it's, it's, it's decades old. It's very historic. Lights are turning off in here, <laughs> just so you know. Lights. It seems like a situation um, where somebody just hasn't bothered to build a bigger concrete dome. Yeah, they probably thought this is not, this is a unnecessary <laughs> yeah. thing. It's like, I'll build a Bass Pro Shop pyramid instead. Yeah. <laughs> the, uh, you, you know, Pop Quiz, do you know the first movie to play there? I know that Mickey Rooney was there. Yeah, yeah. Um, but I don't know what. I read it earlier in this the article. Mad, 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 mad world. Okay. Oh, yeah. Right. I was like, I read it. I literally read it for this, and I mm-hmm. forgot what it was. Yeah. Um, yeah, I have a love hate relationship with the Arc Light. I mean, I don't, uh, as much as I made it so on Twitter that I hated this yeah. place <laughs> and good riddance. Yeah. See you later for charging me full price for a cup of ice water. Oh, and okay. I just remember seeing that. <laughs> whatever. Line. Like, give me In a the break. In the sea of love, I saw yeah. Ryan's Fuck off. vitriol. But it's like, like, there's just, I, I don't get what, what everyone is obsessed with about the arc light here. It, for one, the expensive thing, it is so expensive more than other theaters, I feel like. And their only thing that they offer to me is just going, trust us, we tested the sound and light beforehand. It's good. Well, and then, 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 then the employee comes out and goes, hey, everything cool around here? You know, mm-hmm. like they have their intro guy. Like, who, who it, why, why don't you that guy? It's changed a little bit. But when I was first in L.A., I moved to L.A. in 2006. When I was first here... Arc lights were the only places that did assigned seating. And I don't like oh, that. No. That's my. Oh, no. Assigned, like assigned seating is the way to Fuck go. Assigned seating. No, no, no. First no, no. You're come, crazy. First serve. No, absolutely. You get there that's, early. What, that's how cavemen watch movies. <laughs> that's how that's I watch movies. Okay, right. so, <laughs> sorry for yelling at you. <laughs> Ar- Arc light was great because, number one, they started their movies on fucking time. Mm-hmm. Okay? Because if you went to an AMC. Where do you need to go? If you went to an AMC, <laughs> it would be like 8.15, and then they would run 45 minutes of trailers, and then the two and a half hour Sometimes movie the start. trailer's the best part. It was it was a horrific experience, but Arclight <laughs> would roll their trailers in beforehand, and the movie would start at 8.15, mm, yeah. oh. and assign seating. They'd I, The one thing I didn't like is I don't want someone coming out and telling me the runtime. That's like someone coming out and going, there's a spoiler in this movie. We won't tell you what it is. Yeah. Like, <laughs> there's a twist. Um, a twist. So you, we agree. We don't like the person that comes I, out. I don't, need, I don't need them condescending me before the movie starts. But some of the people were really good. And they seemed, it seemed like it was a cool place. I worked in a movie theater. I was a film lover. Mm-hmm. And in, in my teens, I worked in a movie theater because you just try and get as close to the thing you want to do as possible. Mm-hmm. And it, but it wasn't like that. You were just some sort of like cog in the corporate Machine. The, I work yeah, at a the corporate Simpsons. popcorn machine. But ArcLight at least presented that they liked movies and cared about movies. And boy, do they charge you for that. Well, <laughs> but it's, I really, it doesn't feel like it's that much more. The ice water is bullshit. I'll agree. Uh-huh. But it doesn't feel like it used to be, yeah, if you wanted to go to the ArcLight, you'd pay an extra, like, you know, it'd be like $15 a ticket, but you get assigned seating. So you're like okay, or you could pay ten dollars a ticket and <laughs> wow. just and just try and uh, so you're putting fight a, for fight for your life to get seats at a dark night screening at an AMC. You're putting a big premium on that on that uh, a science. Oh yeah, I put I, to me that's a detriment, and then they're charging me more for it. I don't buy. But it. that's because you don't have anything better to do than I than go ghost. to the movies and I watch two or three or four at a time. All right, so who oh cares? My, God. What, <laughs> my whole yeah. Saturday, I'm going in and out of that. <laughs> okay, yeah. that makes sense. Like, give that's me. why you don't like assigned seating because someone can walk up and go. <laughs> it happens, it happens every time. <laughs> okay, gotcha. well, it pisses me off. Okay, and so it's not just about. The arc light, which by by the way, there was also this picture that I had to look up because in the article I was reading, it said the dome has since hosted dozens of Hollywood premieres, including Shrek 2, for which it was painted green, which this just looks like a tarp. Yeah, that's, that's not painted. Painted. That's wrong. Yeah. And fitted out with tubular ears. Uh, yeah, they were oh. wrong. You should report that article. <laughs> Shrek 2. <laughs> um, but it's, it's, you know, all of the Pacific theaters, like they're... 
everywhere. Yeah. And they're really great theaters. Like, I really like the experience when I go to them because, um, you know, it's like all the things that you said. Yeah. Uh, so it's a lot of locations. And it's like, what do I go to the Regal now? Well, where am I going? I mean, I think where's my closest theater? I, know where you go. I do think that it, that again, when I moved here, ArcLight was head and shoulders above everything else. Yeah, but I do think in Los Angeles, at least, other theaters have desperately tried to compete. So there's a ton of AMC's around here that have assigned assigned seating now and and are have gotten their shit together. So like the I guess Century I look City, up where they are. the Century City AMC. Oh, there is one there. There's a sign seating. Forget seating. I'm on that side of town. There's like three <laughs> AMCs ne- back to back in Burbank, right? Like, yeah, and I, I think they've like stepped like up their game. Standard. Most theaters I go to now. And we don't know what the state yeah. of things are, but the Draft House is also well. That's right. Now that is the that's the number one S tier movie theater experience. If you're listening to me, if you're the head of a of a of a studio of a movie theater chain. The Alamo Draft House is the only thing that can save movies, in my opinion. Like that style of having food come to you during the movie. Yeah, food ninjas. Because oh. that's the only thing that can differentiate between your, oh, yeah. your home cinema now, in my opinion. I, I have I do have a criticism of the draft house though. Sometimes they're so too do loud. I, I feel like that food oh. experience is is detrimental to yeah, the movie. I know experience. Omar, you say that. Yeah. I, I agree with Omar to some extent. There's some movies that I'm fine with it. But I do think that ArcLight was the place you went to if you wanted to watch a fucking movie. Uh-huh. If you wanted to watch a movie. Your goal was to watch a movie. Because I was never even the kind of person who's like, you know what? I can't enjoy this in a, unless I have an extra large bucket of buttery popcorn that I finish before the trailer's no. over. Yeah. I don't need that. I can just sit. I can sit quietly in a theater and for for an hour and a half and and not feel like I need to do, be doing something else. You don't want to get your draft phone house. Out. Draft house is like no cell phones. All that's great. And then 15 minutes in, someone goes, what would you like at your side? Yeah. Like, and, then, <laughs> and they're all crouched and they're whipping back and forth in front of you like gremlins. And I'm like, <laughs> Good point. there's I, more shit going on <laughs> in the theater where they're like, rules, focus on the movie. And then like, they go, would you warm cookie with that? No, I'm okay. I'm just here to watch the movie. Yeah. Oh, do you know your seat goes up? Yeah, I'm good. I'm good. Like, <laughs> Fair enough. Look, you're <laughs> totally right about that. It's just that look, people are going to start, start stop going to the movies. There's no reason the arc light should be going bankrupt, I guess, aside from the pandemic, of uh, which I don't know if you were going to get into this, but I was reading it a little about it as well about, about what's happening here w- about the arc light yeah. and the oh. leases and stuff. Yeah, like yeah. the battle with the landlord. The one in Culver City is the one that I was reading about first, mm-hmm. and that they owed 182,000 in like back rent. Oh my, yeah, but and so yeah, I don't know much more about it. So if you but want to elaborate, this, please do. I was reading. And I think it was in one of these articles that had a lower part that that someone had spoken with an insider that said that this may be a strategy to try and get their to try and get their rent lowered or not have to pay back all this back rent by just saying we're just going to close them because the big thing is they're like we're giving the keys back to the landlord. And when you have all these properties and stuff, I guess because money is theoretical. And people have some people just have so much of it that they go, we don't need any Um, that like a lot of times they'll just go like, well, no, take these like like so like the Cinerama Dome is a good example. What Mm -hmm. what are they going to do? Party City? Like, know, what are they like, going to do put in there? with some of this stuff? Like, when, Ethereum. what are they going to do? I don't know that AMC is necessarily going to think back. it's time for us to expand. Like, a lot of yeah. other theater chains are probably like, whoa, 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 we're not in a position to expand right now. So, like, they have leverage, and if they're like, we'll just close, don't worry, we'll just close the stores, then the landlords will probably come back to the table and say, like, well, hold on a minute. I, I can't see that being a viable, like... Maybe for a few of their locations, yeah. especially this. Really no, not all lines. of them. Yeah. No, but it, I think it is a way to potentially recoup, and then ma- the business might not necessarily go under. I still but. just, it's just. Ryan, remember Mike Dis. Oh yeah, sorry. I have mm-hmm. I I have to remember. Oh to wait, pop also, what, Omar, were you going to just add say the same thing? The draft say the house? same thing about oh about draft about house? the draft house. Oh no, I'm just oh. telling you that's what were you going to say. Yeah. Uh, I think earlier the the thing I was going to say about ArcLight and stuff that made it a nicer experience is they actually stopped people from going into the theater late. Oh, where that yeah, is yeah. like a huge problem with movie theaters. I hate that rule too. Yeah, but the one out here <laughs> stopped really doing that. So like we were paying extra money for the ArcLight and Culver and not really getting that like premium experience anymore. So like, I kind of agree with Ryan where they were kind of fucking us. I would also argue that a, a properly designed theater, you wouldn't necessarily notice people coming and mm-hmm. going. Right. Was it, what's the move? There's a movie theater on the west side 
Um, I don't know them. And it's the one that's built into that mall that's going to become Google or whatever. I don't remember. Either way, there's like a theater, there's a theater, a third theater chain in all this discussion that's over there. And what, if you get one of their screens, it's like room 15 or whatever, you might as well just ask for a refund <laughs> because it the door does not turn 90 degrees. The, the opening, when you open the door to the theater, it shines the light from the lobby directly <laughs> onto the screen. Yeah, yeah, Every yeah. single time it opens, there's oh. not a 90 degree turn. And so I, like, there's been several times where I've gone to see a movie and I, it's in theater 15 or whatever. And I go, never mind. Yeah. I will, no, thank you. <laughs> I feel like I've just been spoiled by theaters out here because, like, for a long time, I'd only gone to theaters like near my hometown and stuff. Mm -hmm. And like, I think like I saw Annihilation there, and it was a theater. The floor was completely flat, like it was just like a oh, flat room with yeah, just, yeah. like a bunch of chairs in it. Yeah, like just like big armchairs bolted to the floor. Yeah, and then coming out here, I feel like I'm I'm living like a king mm -hmm. in all these places. So I, I, my, my yeah, my standards are. Yeah, working their way up. I uh, I look forward to seeing a movie again. I'm glad that you're gonna go tonight. Me too. Or by the time this goes up, <laughs> it's gonna have been a few days. I'm excited to go to the draft house again because I do like that experience. And if I'm gonna want, if I really want to just sit down and like nobody fucking bother me, I'll watch a movie somewhere not the, the not toilet. I hate on the to toilet say it. <laughs> on my iPhone. Movies are dead. It sucks. But, it's happening. We're in the middle of their of the death march to the end of movies. Yeah, they have to change. Bring on the food. In the future, all movies will be Bridgerton. What? <laughs> um, but we are going to have a quick word from our sponsors, and then we will be back with some new topics. Ooh. <laughs> tease. They call that in the industry a tease. Ooh. The internet is the wild west, people, okay? We got information being shuttled from here to there. We got horses, horses. Run. Where are the horses coming? The horse girls, maybe? I don't know. Uh, it's, it's wild out there, which is why using the internet without ExpressVPN is like living in the wild west. Your ISP can see every site you visit. They can sell this information to ad companies and tech giants who will use your data to target you. ExpressVPN stops us with a secure encrypted tunnel between your device and the internet so no one can see your online activity, you adventurous gunslinger, you. <laughs> uh, we use ExpressVPN on our devices at Funhouse. It works on everything, phones, laptops, even routers. And using ExpressVPN is as easy as uh, maybe, you know, swaggering into town, walking up to the saloon, asking for, uh, you know, some, what did they drink in old times? something. Uh, you just fire up the app, click one button, and you're protected. ExpressVPN is the world's number one rated VPN by TechRadar, Wired, The Verge, and countless others. So if, like us, you believe your online activity is your business, secure yourself by visiting expressvpn.com slash dude today and use our exclusive link, expressvpn.com slash dude and you can get an extra three months for free. That's expressvpn.com slash dude. All right, this is a dumb section, so it's not dumb. It's just, it's normal. It's normal. What am I talking about? What a tease. Uh, <laughs> so there's a latest Still entry away. into the tech world of wearable masks. Ooh. And I'm going to tell you guys all about it. I'm sure you heard about it. Ooh. But we'll get there. I just wanted to go over some of the ones that come out uh, that this new mask probably took inspiration from. And we're just going to go over them because this is a fad, right? They say AirPods is a fad, wearable watch with the heartbeat, it's a fad, but a wearable mask. What is the difference between a wearable mask yeah. and an unwearable mask? Yeah. Uh, wearable tech. <laughs> I forgot the word. <laughs> Wait, what? Well, I forgot the word. It's supposed to say wearable tech. Oh. 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 Okay. okay, gotcha. Now I understand. I, I, <laughs> as well. Wearable mask. We got there eventually. Yeah. <laughs> it's a mask. You can't. Oh, say, maybe, been... maybe that Halloween yeah. town is going to go inside. So I was going to show you guys. Mask I was like going to show you some of these masks that are tech masks. You can let me know if like you would ever buy this mask. Okay. Because there's okay. one that came out recently that's like this, and mask. this is capitalizing on pandemic stuff. This is yeah. pandemic. Okay. So they're like masks are here to stay, so we have to figure out how. So to the first one that I think almost came out around a year ago is called the uh, AirPop Active. This is what it looks like. Okay. It's called the AirPop Active. Uh huh. Okay. It's gonna pop up on the screen. When Oh, this isn't animation. it? Oh, oh, there it yeah, is. Yeah, I just, it's, it's an animated slideshow. Uh, okay, guys, I did some Okay, all right. PowerPoint. It tracks, it tracks your, your breathing, breathing. So you okay. can make sure that you are? 
AirPop claims its four layer filters will remove 99.3% of particles and 99% of bacteria. Okay. Wait, how does it track my blah, breathing? Blah, 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 blah. Like, you can Through see my, 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 my breath after yeah. it. It'll tell you. Like, you way, like, this yeah. will track your heartbeat. Is it, what, does it help um, at all if I burp in my mask, though? Yes. Is that going to filter much? any of that out? Maybe. Yeah. $150. Oh, $150. $150. <laughs> the $150. You didn't do the press the button slideshow, huh? Yeah, <laughs> just well, no, he's he's controlling it. Oh, okay, I'm just, gotcha. Uh, which I guess I could just... Uh, so, okay, I was, I'm just going to start and say I would not buy that. Yeah. Especially for $150. For 99.3%. I would never pay more than $20 for a mask that goes over my ears. There, yeah. I said it. I would never pay more than... Well, this $7 list is not for, for you. We know because the first time we saw you after all this started, you told us how you just go down to the corner and uh -huh. buy masks. Yeah. And and as and you were telling fit. us this, they none of them fit your face. Well, now I fit, I, I've gotten better masks. <laughs> You've gotten there. better masks. Yeah, got, those were only five dollars. I go I go up to seven dollars now. Thirty-two degrees, cool. Oh yeah, I that one. I gotta check uh, this receipt. See how much I would not pay more for a mask. Uh -oh. I got the Titans mask. Uh -oh. and the how much mask. did you pay for a mask? I think it was like. 22 bucks for one it, mask. Is it a destiny mask? Maybe. <laughs> okay. It's like a fashion yeah, mask or like something that's like what, but what, how are you gonna uh, what raid did you have to finish solo in order to be allowed to buy that mask? Oh, you know, just like all, of, you know, beat the des beat destiny. Easy peasy. Oh, destiny one. Doesn't even matter so anymore. The, okay. The next mask is this one. Hmm. It's called the LG Pure Care that looks heavy. Wearable. Yeah. yeah it's, and the yeah, fact it's that they huge. couldn't even get a man to actually wear it and had to Photoshop, Photoshop. it on him, <laughs> that yeah, makes me... The, the nose clearly doesn't line up. Look yeah. at the shadows. Uh, if you click on it, it'll show the title. I, I wouldn't okay. pay a penny over $170 okay. for this. This one includes two high-quality HIPAA filters that can remove at least 99% of particulates in the air down to 0.3 microns in size. It's garbage, yeah. yeah it's blah, 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 blah. Oh, Who cares? Okay. <laughs> It's just another mask. It's an LG mask. It's but huge. Oh, what? It doesn't have any cool features like tracking your breathing. It looks <laughs> like a VR. Cool it looks like VR for your mouth. You can't even buy this one here. There's like when I was looking on the websites to find out how much it was, it was like Hong Kong prices. I finally found one on eBay. You can buy it for $170 on eBay. I don't get it. Uh, see, oh, I, I guessed it exactly right. It's mm -hmm. not. So I didn't even it's, peek and look at her slideshow at all. Is, you're cheer. gonna be paying yeah. way more than it. Oh. It just does mask things, and it's, it's huge. Just a mask. Yeah. Um, the next one, you guys, I'm sure you've seen this oh, one. Oh, it's Darth the Razor or... Hazel. Yeah. The Project Hazel. It's not out. Also looks very heavy. Yeah. Uh, like... <laughs> Razor RGB Project Hazel is what it's called. It's mm -hmm. got RGB lights. Yeah. It's got lights. Okay. Cool. Cool. Does it does it uh, does it have a voice changer? No. Does it change your voice? Yeah, be really dark. No, but that would be cool. They, uh, there's no price and there's no release date. There's a lot of the masks that have filters on them, though, don't protect anyone around you. That's like one that, of the big things. It's too. not the filter; it's the valve. If it has a one-way valve, it okay. doesn't protect the people around you. Well, then what okay, the so fuck? This is this is, is this is. I mean, that looks like there's a lot spewing out at me. Like but a yeah, is that, it's, and it's it, just like it a boom projects box. your voice. I'm pretty sure that's the thing. Is oh, that maybe like so. your, your voice like it's it goes before, through a speaker. Before we go on, can I just say yeah, that please. I think that there is a market if we want to upcharge people for masks. I think there are things that can be done. This is not it, right? We need to focus less on oh, 99 percent of particular. We're fine. Okay, uh -huh. if you have a, a quality mask, it's going to protect you uh -huh. for the most part, right? But what we need to have is stuff in there that, like, you can press a button mm -hmm. on your phone and then it miss the smell of freshly baked, baked cookies or something. Oh, like or like different things like that. LED screens well, or something. I right? mean, I guess maybe, but that's, that's so I'm just saying, like, if we're going to cover the nose and the mouth. Let's focus on what those things do and its taste. Uh -huh. So you could just be walking around all day with the smell of warm cookies. So people look through your transparent mask and see you just like. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So 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 you're wanting to replace the functions of nose and mouth, or, or, or add like cool robot. I'm features. just saying, no one cares about having LED lights on the outside or having it measure your breathing. Well, That's the, the fine. breathing I agree, but I do think that the more colorful and if we if I if I had an LED light uh, of my mouth, right, or, or an LED like a video screen, 
Okay. That actually was my mouth. So it's like I'm wearing a mouth mask, but you can't tell. And it rear like projects. It rear projects. You my, see what your I'm mouth? saying? Like I think the, that would be pretty cool. Like, but it's like you need one of those, those things that spin really fast, and then the, the it like spin? makes a picture. Yes. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. Like Doctor Strange it, hands. So, yeah. <laughs> yeah. So you could just have a different face. Do you guys think that would be cool? Sure. I think that's more complex. I'm trying to put us within the realm of possibility, and oh. I think a cookie. I think a cookie dough mask. <laughs> you don't mask. I like to like if you could uh, sync up the RGB with what movie you're watching. You know, like people do that with their TVs and stuff. They oh, put the lights behind but, it. But, but why are you? What, so when you go to that Cinerama dome with your mask on. Oh, and then you're, you're distracting everybody. Yeah. Have you ever had cool. like a stray hair somewhere within yeah. oh, your yeah. periphery? I mean, look at the and you're like, all, all right, I'm just gonna grab it, and it's not, and you're not even close. Yeah, you're like, and you run. can't get it because the the eyes and the brain can't process things that are like that close. And then you look in the mirror and you're like, oh, it's on my ear. And you pull it off. You're like, what the, how did I think that's it was there? Life. That's what, that's what it would be like. If you have those lights flashing, it's going to be like that. You're going to be trying to watch the movie, but like, you're going to have things and then you're going to see the squiggles in your eyes. And so is everybody else around you too. Yeah. They're going to see your It's RGB. like the scene in the jerk when the, you know, when he, ha when he has those little things that help mm -hmm. his, the nose yeah, and yeah. Then it, it draws the dude's eyes to it. And yeah. the film director doesn't say cut in time. And then the uh, car goes over the cliff. Yeah. It's like that scene. What are you going to say, Lindsay? Um, I don't, I don't know. You had me so engrossed in that. How much do you think this mask would be? Two hundred and twenty dollars. I feel like they're gonna charge. Razor. Do you think they'll Razor. ever actually release this? I thing? don't think so. I don't think so. I think didn't they say recently they were gonna do it? Like they had the concept. Yeah, this is recent. This this was announced like in bucks. January. -ish. I think ninety nine dollars. Yeah. yeah, but Razor but, doesn't upcharge. Yeah, there's 20. no more details on it. Um. The phone or the scooter? However, here is a mask that I definitely think will be coming out soon. It's the new Whoa. Will I Am Super Mask. This is how it's spelled. Super mask. Does it come with a hearing aid? Does it come with a oh, sweet glasses? Super mask. Okay. So let me tell you everything this mask has, okay? Right. Cookie dough scent? No, but you know, maybe. There's still time. Okay. Dual three speed fans and HEPA filters. Okay. Well, those HEPAs. It's okay. got built in active noise canceling headphones. Oh. Is that? Those are just oh, buds. Your bud, yeah. Okay. okay. It's got a microphone. It's got okay. Bluetooth. It's got magnetic earbud docking system. Okay. So that means that it clips to there. It's got LED <laughs> glow, day glow lights, which I don't know what that means. Oh, so that way. Guess how much day, this is. Not dark, so you can see during the day. Yeah, exactly. Before it goes on there. Guess how much this mask is. You, you saw no, it. No, I'm not going to. I'm going to go. Two. Two. Fifth. No, 260. $400. 400 dollars not a dollar over two ninety nine. <laughs> wow, Brian, you're so ac you're so good. Whoa! You're so talented. <laughs> this mask is three hundred dollars, and I think it's like uh, coming. Like, I I saw this uh, uh today, and I saw it on Sunday. Where how how where is this attached to him? It goes behind. I think it goes behind it's not, his head. It's, I think it's oh, really, oh, it's behind his head like and it has a hole for it. It's like the okay. Bane mask. Gotcha. I was like, because it's not looped around his ear, oh, yeah. <laughs> so it goes behind the head. All right. Well, you've got me already there because behind the head is where I want my masks. Yeah. Really? So Honeywell. Yeah. It's way more comfortable. And yeah. Super Mask. That's what it's called. All right. Super Mask. This is this is my winner so far. I also like the fabric look yeah. of it. It feels like it'd be the most comfortable, less weight, less forward weight. I don't want more horse horse like appearances of people, but if we look more like you know, right. I'm gonna this put up a, your your yours. Lindsay. This is a proper. You what? Logo. Oh, never mind. You yeah, it. you can do it if you want. I was gonna and show it's so this. So cheap. Show, too, yeah, show this. This is what I was looking at. This is the website. Okay. Okay. Oh, wow. So here's the mask. Uh, it doesn't Let's look just. As good from where the do the earbuds go when you're not using them? They have the magnetic dock. Yeah, they're stuck on. They're under those the two side. big circles on the front. No, I think they're right. Uh, I would guess I think that they're yeah. they're like little clips that come out, and it's then you can dock a little them there. a little magnetic part. Yeah. So when I accidentally pull one off and it just falls on the sidewalk, it'll be gone forever. I was just gonna show like this to see if there was footage of the whatever. The, the, the mask super mask. How do you even pronounce that? Zupa. Uh, no, it is pronounced super mask. <laughs> what? Yeah. <laughs> uh, nice. I like the catch. Wow. Oh, look at that. There it is. Green jello. We can see right, the mask. He's on his actually. bike and he's free. It does go, yeah, right around the head. It's for working out. It's Bane. This is a Bane mask. It looks mask, very Bane-ish. goes all the way around the back of the head though, like that. I you, was so you born into the virus. It, you have to charge your mask. Charge my mask, huh? Yeah. yeah. 
Yeah, otherwise you, you can't breathe anymore. Yeah. <laughs> so it's something you can't get well, it's a monthly. There. It's actually monthly payments. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's a subscription. And if you don't pay, if your your credit card expires or whatever, it'll just stop. You'll stop being. But here's my thing. So those little like thingies hang off, and the, but they attach to the mask medi- um, magne- mm-hmm. magnetically. That's yeah. Funny. And then, so that way you don't have to switch your ear pods every time you like take your mask off. Because yeah, then like. Some dangles. Oh my god. No, this is a fad. Yeah, you can see they're <laughs> stuck down there. Tech masks. Fad. Oh, there's actual fans. I, there's I fan agree thing. it's a yeah, fad. I said there was too I fad. agree it's a fad as well because Here's this in one. America, we don't care enough about no. other people That's to wear masks the way other countries that wear masks year round wear masks. Do you think that's yeah. the right. solu- the reason we don't well, care about other people? Yeah. Yes. yes. How long do you think people will continue to wear masks into this year? Not long. They're already I, done. No, there's already people I know that are not wearing masks. I think people have already stopped, and I think there are places where people never started. Yeah. And I think you may see you may see it in more urban areas, mm-hmm. like probably like New York, L.A., Seattle. Yeah. Like the yeah. Coastal elites, as it were. <laughs> You'll probably you'll probably see people continuing to wear masks and maybe wear masks when they're sick. I went to see my mom in Arizona and she was telling me how just like the week before that because like they're in Phoenix area and their people are still wearing masks mm-hmm. in places, but some of the smaller restaurants because it's not mandated there anymore are like, well, we don't have we can do whatever we want. Yeah, Chili's is going to enforce the federal mandate, right? Target's yeah. going to enforce the federal mandate. Yeah. and then she went on a little vacation to like a place couple hours south and she's like you would not go there yeah well i think that's she's like stuff. nobody's wearing masks the, the technology masks even the places that like your hardcore mask wearing regions la and new york i'm saying that i still think that this stuff won't catch on even here is kind of like, oh yeah well it won't like, just because no one cares that yeah, enough about yeah, the yeah, fucking yeah. mask yeah and, like, all the uh, amenities i agree you know yeah. No, nobody. That one looks cool, though. Yeah, you know. I can't remember where I saw it, but or what country it was in. It was a mask that you like unzipped, and there's a mouth, so you could like open it and start eating. That was Germany, probably. (laughs) And it was long before the pandemic. (laughs) Yeah, I mean, I'm just gonna stick to my regular old. What if they put sunglasses on it too? Well, I have a motorcycle helmet and a hat that has uh, like a sun, like basically glasses built in. Mm -hmm. So like, there's the visor that goes down. Mm But then, if you if it's bright out, you can press another thing, and it flips down a, a, a shaded visor that basically works like sunglasses. Nice. Or if you want to have it like the air cool, you can flip the main visor up, and then just the sunglasses down. So then your eyes are protected, but you still get a breeze. So these people should take it farther, and we should they should just be making motorcycle helmets that we all wear. We should around. all wear Astronaut Daft helmets. Punk yeah. helmets, right? That'd be yeah. pretty cool. They just cool. They, they just break up. There's a hole in the, they, they in could the make it last. market. Yeah, that's we where could, we, we could all be deaf. Slot in. <laughs> mm-hmm. yeah. But I mean, I'm good with just my little mask collection. I have a bunch of them. I never thought that I would. I might get one nice mask, mm-hmm. like mm-hmm. one the ones that you just swap oh, the filters I did get one. in and out of. My boyfriend got me like an Under Armour mask, and it's like really. Ooh. nice. That's what I, I might. I might get one of those. Just uh, just for that'll be gym. my mask Your for the future. Yeah. yeah, basically. Yeah, my, oh. my, my black tie mask. <laughs> my black tie mask. <laughs> <laughs> Um, but yeah, I remember like a year ago when I was moving and it was two or three weeks into the pandemic and John was coming to help me move. Like neither of us had masks. So I think he had got one last super last minute and I literally tore up an old pillow case <laughs> and tie, I did like the one that the got the, the attorney the general hair, showed you how to do. Yeah, the hair, or, hair ties. Yep. And then you, I couldn't even remember how to do it. Couldn't even tell you how to do it now. It was mm-hmm. so long ago, but I had little sheet. Sheet masks, pillowcase masks. I remember. Hey, he I was there. He should make a pizza posse mask. <laughs> Maybe he should. Oh, he there should. There you go, John. Yeah. Yeah. Pizza you posse. listening, John? He's not. <laughs> <laughs> Ryan wore the shirt today. Just I did John. wear the shirt today. The shirt. You know what? Shirt. James Good Williams you. also wore the shirt. Today. I wore the shirt and I went, "Are we both wearing John shirts?" <laughs> and then, and then and Ryan, Ryan, I didn't want to. I didn't want to wear the same shirt as Ryan. Mine was red, I guess. So that I found another <laughs> that was shirt. different. I can't believe you changed. I wanted to be twins with you. <laughs> we coordinated it and everything, it and then you had to go change moment. it. It would have been adorable. Oh yeah, there was one more uh, mask that I just. <laughs> can you show the last slide on that thing, Omar? It's not a mask. It's the thing. Well, it's well, like the thing. It's the tent thing. Well, oh yeah, like the it. thing we did at Among, Among Us. Us? Yeah. Well, I grabbed the one. It's right behind the you. biovisor. It's called the biovisor. It's dark. Oh, there yeah, it is. Yeah, there it is. Yeah. And, and it's three hundred and seventy-nine dollars. Got one right here. 
Wow. All right. Yeah, this we that's, got it right here. And how that's, much is this? That's a lot of money to get punched in the face. I don't want to, I don't want to get. <laughs> You're going to break this one too, Ryan. I don't want to get whatever you guys have. <laughs> $379 for this, huh? Yeah, look at well, it. Oh, no. Mm. There's a little bit nicer. Why but, is it spelled visor different on the chest than it is in the... Yeah, who... Yeah. Who spelled it wrong? They or you? I probably spelled it wrong. <laughs> it's probably a Y. But also, it's like, okay, you're going to wear this, and then you're in the airport, and then you're sitting next to somebody on Spirit Airlines, and you're like... Yeah, no one's going to wear this. No. Some company got capital, venture capital, to design this or whatever. Ooh, and it's Looks like it's got a little fanny pack there. Yeah, you can keep your things in there, like smaller <laughs> your <masks>. objects. <laughs> <laughs> um, but that's it. That's it for the masks. I How think what we do is, if you really want this to take off, you got to market it to children. We got to get Nerf masks. Gamify it. There are oh, those. Nerf masks. I uh, do. They also shoot. They nerfs? could, but I think if you if you make it the kind of thing that like, oh, for Christmas your kid is really asking you for this mask, mm -hmm. then that'll make the next generation. Like understand mass culture better. I have an idea, because uh, uh, kids like cool games and stuff, That's right? True. I've interact been told, yes. Stuff, social media stuff, computer stuff, mm -hmm. YouTube stuff. What if, like uh, before, you put a cool LED screen okay. on your mask, right. and then uh, you know that game where you like had a uh, you had to like guess whatever the word people had yeah, on their don't wake daddy. Yeah. So yeah, it's that thing, but with your face, your mouth. It's just the words there, and you can. Do that kind of, you know, or play other games. So masks well, are games now. They should That's just, how you make them. Well, you uh, know, like the kids. holders and stuff. Like, they, remember when everyone had a selfie stick? Mm -hmm. Uh-huh. Just oh, get man. a thing that you can put your phone on your mask. Yeah. Oh. So cool. And so you can attach you your go. phone here, uh -huh. and then you and your friends can play mouth-based games. <laughs> There we go. I think mouth-based games is where it's at, and that's how you make it actually take off. I God, agree. I love a good mouth-based game. Yeah, I agree. Your, all your plans, though, Ryan, involve LED screens. So I feel like adds like a plus one hundred dollar. But I feel like I've seen this. I feel like I've seen somebody have a cool thing where it was kind of like what Omar said, where it was it was one of those really fast things that I yeah yeah they yeah, spin. spin. It's it, yeah. But I, the lady so I feel dances. like we're there. You can have an LED screen or more. I think that's easier to have a phone holder in your mouth so that you yeah. can just do and it then on. you get an app. Yeah. Then now there's a whole app industry. For or things that work in tandem with the masks. Uh, yeah, exactly. So, like, it's a smiley face, Happy. but then you, like, do this, face and games. it feels it, and it's a frowny face. Well, yeah. <laughs> so it's just your mouth on, the, yeah. on your phone. Right. Or is it a cartoon video. mouth? Oh, and then like you could have fun things where like hillbilly teeth, mask with you know, like yeah, great we stuff. Yeah, just come up with a bazillion dollar idea. The That's mask, mask industry. that exists that tells you, that, oh, like, moves with your uh -huh. mouth. There we go. Is it the Rorschach mask? Voice? That Matt Peak made for Halloween that one year? Oh, yeah. Wow, look at that. Hell $16, yeah. huh? Six, 16 bucks? That was like 30 times less than your other weird ass. What do you guys define as a funny pattern? Uh, that pattern is hilarious. Someone was like, look, funny patterns. Look, I go, I don't think it is. I've got a face on my mouth. Yeah, I thought there was one that like does it where you're talking and it like, oh yeah, this LED voice activated... Uh huh. Mask this funny si face simulates your mouth. So everything I was saying exists for sixteen bucks, and James was saying it was too futury. I don't know that I like the lithium polymer battery on my face, though. <laughs> I mean, I you think don't I'm like gonna the lick buy batteries <laughs> because I gotta see, right? I got. I'm gonna get one just to see what. It'd be great. If Mardi Gras, wet, it'll rave, you, yeah. carnivals, and more. Um. <laughs> oh, rave. But anyways. Oh, yeah, oh, this baby. is not me. I oh, was, I don't know. Yeah. Omar's doing some good Google. Omar, I mean, plague doctor mask. <laughs> yeah. They were they were ahead of the that's, but that's that's what they did. Do you know what they used to do with those? Why the nose is so large? Oh, because they no. put they put incense yeah. in there so that way they didn't have to smell the bodies that are decomposing. Just like oh. I'm gonna have cookie dough oh. in my mask, so I don't have to smell all of your stink ass. See, I didn't know that. You I get your I've plague doctor guy. stuff full of cookie dough. Some he designed this mask that uh, the pattern for this mask that okay talks. So now you this can is talk. super cute. Does that mean there's something like like you're like a horse? That <laughs> no, has, like, the way that he stitches <laughs> it like and like the, it's like flat across his mouth, but the way that the rest of it is yeah, stitched together, like the wolf masks that yeah. you can buy. Anyways, it eases your chin. Um, well, okay, uh, right. we're gonna take here a quick word from another one of our sponsors, and yes. then we will be right back with a new. Mini game that I made up for you guys. Whoa. Wow! Gonna win. If there's one thing we've learned about big wireless providers and their fine print contracts, it's that there's always a catch. So when we at Funhouse first learned about Mint Mobile's premium wireless service starting at just 15 bucks a month, we asked ourselves, what's the catch? But after using Mint Mobile, realized 
There isn't one. So what is their secret sauce? They're the first company to sell wireless service online only, cutting out crazy overhead costs and mystery fees. I, I like a good mystery, but not when it comes to my quiche. So Mint passes on sweet savings directly to you. John Smith, our very own wonderful John Smith, he's Mint Mobile, still uses it, I believe, and loves it. Saves him money every single month. Mint Mobile offers premium wireless for just 15 bucks a month. All plans have unlimited talk and text plus high-speed data on the nation's largest 5G network, and you can keep your existing phone and number when you switch over. So to get your new wireless plan for just $15 a month and get it shipped to you for free, go to mintmobile.com slash dude. That's mintmobile.com slash dude, D-U-D-E, and cut your wireless bill to 15 bucks a month. Mintmobile.com slash dude. Thanks, Mint Mobile. When there's gaming to be done... Running to the post office is probably not how you want to spend your time, am I right? But you know what saved me a bunch of time? That's Stamps.com. Stamps.com lets you mail and ship anytime, anywhere. Uh, I personally have used it to send mail and postage to Canada, to friends and family back home, so international. Stamps.com brings the U.S. Postal Service and UPS right to you with discounted rates. It's a must-have for any business, whether you're a small office, an online seller, shipping out orders, or even a giant warehouse. Stamps.com handles it all. From your computer, print official U.S. postage 24-7 for any class of mail going anywhere. Then just schedule a pickup or drop it off. Stamps.com saves you time and move money. It's no wonder nearly 1 million small businesses already use stamps.com. So stop wasting time going to the post office and go to stamps.com. Instead, there's no risk. And with our promo code DUDE, you get a special offer that includes a four-week trial, plus free postage and a digital scale. No long-term commitments or contracts. Just go to stamps.com, click on the microphone at the top of the homepage, and type in DUDE. That's stamps.com, promo code DUDE, D-U-D-E. Stamps.com, never go to the post office again. All right. Uh, okay, we are back. And uh, what's up? How's the chat doing? Good? No, they're doing they good. They the Razor Mask us? would be great for raves. That's true. But that one was good for rave. The Amazon one. Yeah, I actually might get that and then go to a rave. What am I? I'm fucking 33. I'm going to go I'm gonna to a rave. I'm going to use it, but I'm going to wear it like a, I know, it's a really bikini tiny. bottom. Oh, so you got a little happy yeah, face? so I'll have a little, yeah, smile will be sideways, but. <laughs> um. Okay, so this game, you guys have played, all played GeoGuessr, right? No. Okay. Nope. You, you used your geography skills and your context clues to figure out where you are in the world. Mm -hmm. Okay. I uh, am an avid Reddit user. Love going on Reddit. Love our shout out to our uh, fun house subreddit. I use old Reddit, old dot Reddit, and mm -hmm. they still have like the random button that's at the top, mm -hmm. which I don't, I don't think new Reddit has it. So I said, what if we play a new game where I click on a random subreddit and you guys don't get to see the title? And you have to read yes. the post and oh, okay. subread it. Okay. I like this. Yeah. So go ahead <laughs> and show if it's lined up properly. Show the one that I had already started. Not safe for work furries. Come, uh, <laughs> let's see. Do you have you picked these or you got actually done? No, they're right? gonna go random. Okay, okay. They're okay. gonna go random. So this, this is Conference a subreddit stocks, right here. If we have to abstinence, anything abstinence later. Abstinence subreddit. Incel subreddit. Needs belly. This is a Mormon thing. It's definitely a Mormon. Mormon thing. Mormons oh. don't belong to the. Uh, I mean, but it's got to. The thing is, Reddits aren't just called what they are. Yeah. They have like there's sub there's like they have like some yeah, of them are some sort of kitschy term for it. Joseph Smith. How do I a non believer? Maybe like karate. Like something like like how skeptical to, Mormon yeah. or how something like Mormon. that. Like okay. how yeah uh, Mormon but propaganda. This is, it's Reddit. not just this. Isn't just Mormonism, right? Yeah. These are people questioning. Religion and Mormonism, yeah. it seems like. Uh, they're like self dot Mormon. But they're also not hypercritical. They're like Oh yeah, I guess in. don't read those little parts because yeah. Okay, it's the Mormon subreddit. Oh it's just Oh it is. Oh, it is, it is yeah. the Mormon subreddit. <laughs> oh, okay. okay. Just read the blue. Try not to look at the little pieces because some Ignore, of those that's are impossible. Read. I know. <laughs> there, there's like a ten different places. Okay. Can you just uh, I was like, can you see if there's one called Skeptical Mormon? Because <laughs> I feel like that's a good subreddit. All right, I will blur okay. my eyes like, and I, not I, read those Listen, I love God, but I also kind of want to do anal. Like, <laughs> okay, so here's another I subreddit. I just click the random button. Okay, this right, one try not to, Okay, it doesn't have it. It doesn't have it. Okay. Uh, Tapu Koko deck. deck. Arokuda deck. It's a Pokemon, Pokemon yeah. cards. Tournament winning. Prisoner yeah, this is definitely... Card. What is it? Uh, is there a term for it? Pokemon, Pokemon card counting. Deck building. Pokemon. Yeah. Pokedeck. Poke something like that. T TCG. Trading card game. Oh. oh, yeah. Pokemon TCG. Oh. 
But see, look, uh, the flare has lots of deck stuff in it, so maybe there's like deck in there somewhere. Yeah. So Pokemon deck builder. Yeah, probably. this one is PKM N T C G. Pokemon TCG. Pokemon All right. The card yes, you're 100 percent right. Pokemon we are good. Pokemon TCG network. I also realized right there I had the rules, oh, but you know yeah, we're getting better. You guys are just it's a new game. It last minute. It's a new <laughs> yeah. game. Flush and um, All right, so we got crypto. No. Okay. Yeah. Bingus is a B. Okay. Crypto charities. Is it like bit? It's Bitcoin. Something. <laughs> no. or I mean, it says it in a lot of places, but I don't know what Binance is. Oh yeah, oh, is it Binance. Binance? Yeah, is it, is it Bitcoin, Bitcoin Binance? Binance yeah. I guess? No, it's yeah. an, it's a, that, that's an app for, for crypto stuff. Oh, it's an oh, app. There you go. Okay, good to know. Or a, all right. Yeah. Okay. okay. Luckily, it's random. So we got endless. Endless. This is, right. I think package links. <laughs> Monster Hunter World Iceborne update 15.02. <laughs> James cheated on that one. I saw him look at the little thing. All right. Thing. Pretend <laughs> I didn't look at it. Now figure out what it is. All right. Okay. Uh, All right. Let's see. Uh, oh, S.A. Oh, oh, weed. Oh, weed, weed, Santa weed. Anna. Santa Anna. Santa Anna. What? Marijuana or, decriminalization bill. No, no, no. San Antonio. This is about local. This is about some yes, location. Local. It's a location <laughs> thing. Because there's different things all about this place. Yeah. Food and drink. Uh, dispensary. Texas. Texas, San Antonio. Oh, okay. San Antonio. I mean... I did not look at it. Why does that show that? I, I wish I could hide that. It might I, just depend on the page. I, tried, I had working with, with Omar so hard to get it to, like, not show the top yeah. and, and not show the right. That's how they get you. Yeah. It might just depend on the, on the subreddit. Like, here's what, here's what, if you really fun want fun. to do with the fun game. Yeah. And you want, it, you could theoretically not show us and read just us. Read oh, oh, yeah. Here we go. All right. Yeah. All right. Maybe... Just read you some can of the headlines. Ryan, viewers, put your mask you guys back are not on. Okay, to we won't way, look. Okay? We won't look. You have to look Wait, that oh, way. Hold on one sec. <laughs> what? I, I'm going to change the way that this is laid out. Hold on. Oh, oh okay. Omar's going to fix it. Fix on the fly. Omar's going to on the fly crop each one of those as they appear. And I know because it does like show up a little bit different every time. It smells in here. I mean, you reading it will still prevent us from seeing other context clues yeah. in there. Yeah. Yeah, I didn't even realize that the whole self dot whatever because that's the discussion post mm -hmm. and that's going to be on a lot of the subreddits. But I still thought it, this was a fun game. I felt like I was training myself to avoid it pretty well. There you go. Mm -hmm. um, okay, so here's one that I have. Okay. Uh, it's called uh, Any Way to Keep Echo Show 5 at Volume 0. Okay. How to Disable Did You Know Suggestions slash Ads. So it's like a, like an assistant thing. Like custom well, wait times question mark custom wait times echo dot not compatible through Google Chrome oh Amazon echoes Alexa right that's the one ding 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 Shit, I don't know it. It's oh, Alexa God. he got Alexa I feel like we were okay I like this one all we're right just so it this about. one are, are you wearing um, that thing backwards I'm trying not Jacob said I had we're not so I can't just see don't it. look that way look at the camera he can't be trusted <laughs> Ryan can't be trusted <laughs> can't be trusted we can't be heard anymore either so all right uh, we're not looking at it anymore here's uh here's one. New Mexico becomes 16th state to legalize marijuana, a rebuttal to Weed America's subreddit. failed war on drugs. Let me finish this. It's called trees. LSU frat brothers pay off mortgage a beloved house cook 30 years later, the most giving person. Oh, this is probably like good news. Yeah. Or something like, like heartwarming, yeah. uplifting. White Minnesota cop who fairly, oh, that's No, pretty that's pretty probably intense. not. Uh-oh. I know where that's going. Uh, <laughs> a toxin behind mysterious eagle die-offs may have finally been found. Headlines. This uh, is, good news. Yeah, like, this is like, I mean, these are all like just good U.S. Christmas? headlines. Yeah. Not good news. Argentine, Argentine penguins waddle back to sea after rehab Maybe on just dry news. Land. Isn't yeah. that good? That's a good news? That's good, but there wasn't. It's not always good, though. Yeah. Oh. What kind of news is it besides good? It's uh, uplifting. Feel good? I'm right. Uplifting news. Uplifting news. Wow, Ryan. So I didn't even need to be inside the thing. All right, ready? Here's another one. Okay. Uh, this is this one says House Professor Warren Ewens. Uh, summer pay. Okay. Stat four thirty versus math two forty. Okay, you get some context clues coming. What's going on? Ooh. Okay. Is this like a first? This is like a this college a class. Yeah. yeah. College to and professor critiques. Chem two forty one prof plus advice for fall 2021. Definitely seems like it's specific to a, probably a school specific right. uni advice. I work for a nonprofit that is bringing 100% free coding classes to Philly. This is a Philadelphia okay. school. Okay. Is it Penn? That's right. He got it. Oh, wow. Nice. Wow. How do you like that? Okay. Good job, James. Um, all right. 
Thanks. Ready for the next one. This is called my lockdown. Uh, an interactive vintage map builder. I couldn't say some of the words because that was the name of the subreddit. If Slack and a clubhouse had a baby, uh, free Dubai rental cost calculator. Dubai is this okay, like that one threw me off a little bit. Remote is this like remote work subreddit or something? Social media where you get paid for being helpful. Yeah, it's on like or something like that. Yeah, like subreddit. working from yeah, how to work from home and get paid money. What was that Dubai one though? Uh, well, that, maybe there was an move to Dubai. It could have been an ad. Oh, <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, okay. It could have been an ad. Sometimes it's hard to tell. <laughs> yeah. Especially when you're looking at a new subreddit. Yeah. Uh, sub reply, not another social network. You guys are pretty close. Made the, here is made my side project completely free. All right. Uh, Work from home tips. Or called something. side projects. Side, oh, side, side projects. projects. Okay, got it. Okay. All right, here we go. Next one. <laughs> you can't uh, be trusted. Oh, this is the PS battle. That one's hard to describe without just saying PS uh, battle. Yeah. Um, oh, here we go. Robo Doug. Robo Doug? Gorbel's Plasterer Rap. F- fantasy subreddit. Uh, Gorbel's Plasterer Rap. I need another one. Yeah. There's like pictures. Robo Doug. Robo Doug. Tough. Snick. The Snick subreddit. Futuristic Snick. Scotland has turned into the designated driver. Scotland has turned into the Oh, boy, it's getting more confusing. <laughs> this would be better if you guys could look at jokes? these pictures. <laughs> Those pictures? Yeah. Describe them. Here, look at a picture. Okay. Look at this picture. It's a picture of some words. Oh, the whole browser is showing now, but it's fine. song. It's Scottish oh. People Twitter. Oh. oh. That's the name of the subreddit? Yeah. I feel like Scottish this one people w- Twitter. Scottish people Twitter. Would've, I would have never oh, gotten boy, that. Uh, that's to show pictures for this one. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right, let's move on to the next one. Okay. All right. Let's do like a, a handful more. Um, this one's a little too intense. Okay. Hey, okay. <laughs> good call, Lindsay. Good call. <laughs> graphic, graphic violence subreddit. Um, I, I actually, I saw it. Oh, I'm okay. sorry. Oh, you saw it? Here we go. You ready for this, this one, Omar? Oh, God. <laughs> God, I don't know which one to read because he's probably going to get any of them right Just away. Just do it. Just go. There's there's no there's no obfuscating this. Why the Traveler Stayed? Oh, Destiny, the game. <laughs> Destiny lore. <laughs> Destiny lore? Oh. There was no way that Is I was going to... Is there a gonna... post from Jacob on the front? No, no, don't okay. scroll down. Don't scroll down. Is this not your toilet read, <laughs> Jacob? <laughs> Oh no, I go straight to the source. Ugh. Ugh. I was like, I'm not gonna be able to. All right. Wait, wait. Oh, wait. Sorry. Uh, you want me to. You, you, yeah, sorry. He wants to check uh, out the subreddit. <laughs> what are they talking about Let's there? Let's see. Oh, uh, they're trying. Okay, okay. Uh, uh, just, okay. New antagonist for the Vault of Glass. Okay, we can move on. Mm-hmm. I just wanted to see what's hot and new and, you know. Hot and new. All right. They'll be messaging you about more. that. <laughs> <clears throat> Fate of the Elder Gods Discord for organized play on TTS. Okay. Okay. Video games. It's a I game. Mean, board uh, games. Uh, yeah. Video games. Um, tabletop simulator. Okay. Yeah. Yep, it's tabletop oh, okay. simulator. Oh, okay. Yeah. Nice. Okay. That TTS. Board games, tabletop simulator. <laughs> uh, let's see. Am I winning? What was that one? I don't know. I'm scared. I'm, I'm Have we hit any not NSFW ones yet? No, because I'm not logged in, so like I don't know if it's like oh, oh, wow. Well, okay, so here's it's, the thing. Oh, yeah. 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 When I was logged one. in, the random button functions as like my personal random, so it was only showing me uh, from your own super, subreddit. like uh, I guess tailored subreddits. Yeah, yeah. So I was like, how many you know Stardew Valley subreddits are there? Turns out a lot. We should hook it up to Ryan's account and see what the random pulls up. <laughs> um, let's not. <laughs> um, just trying to find a couple here. All right, here we go. Here's one. Surfing. Our surfing. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> surfing. What would you prefer to use more for survival, an illustrated book or an illustrated app and why? Boy Scouts. Survival. Living forever in the wild, it's survival. He Prepper. It. Okay, oh. nice. Nailed it, Ryan. Good. Immediately. I need to start throwing stuff out there. Yeah. <laughs> Some of these I'm just like, I don't know what's going on, so I'm just skipping over it quickly. <laughs> don't yeah. want to be on some like weird. You already have been. Yeah, trust already. Me. You got to have faith. I know. We'll I've figure been it out. Through. We'll solve these mysteries. All right. Are you, you're browsing in an incognito window, right? I am actually because I didn't want to log out. Or no, I'm not. <laughs> There's Uh-oh. my little icon right there. <laughs> uh, 
just want to share a really cool play I remember from my rec days. Theater. Um, does anyone have any experience with rotator cuff? Okay. Tears, lebron tears. What's the recovery advice? like? Creative writing like, advice. Well, uh, so wait, wait, consistent wait, injuries in a short, medium span of time. Please stop playing full court in a public area. <laughs> oh, basketball. Uh, pick up basketball. games. Uh, oh. Basketball. Wait, what did the first thing? Oh, wait, what it was? That's all right. Can't I? Can't I can't with, with basketball in hand, but I can get my hand over the rim. <laughs> Help! <laughs> basketball separated. Help. Help! Can you dunk, James? Oh, man. I wish I, I would have. Probably not. No. I feel like probably not. Me either. All right. I'm going to do a few more. And then we'll call okay. it. Look away. Uh, look I, away. I already saw it. I'm sorry. I, I, I ruined that one. I know. We can still play. Jacob and I play. Yeah. yeah. Jacob and James can still play. Still let Ryan speak. I won't speak. Put your mask on. Right. First time up for orders. Looking for advice. Separation orders. due to money. Information needed. SAPR representative. Trying to go FTS. Can't find required NKOs. Oh boy, that's a lot of uh, acronyms. Banking. In this one. Tattoos. Oh, our banking. Oh, this is going to be impossible. Our, our job. I'm trying to thing. find one. Yeah. Uh, one uh, that I could say. Destiny again. Did not know we had a blimp at one point. What? <laughs> our uh, good good year. Great work on the desk, CBs. Our office politics. I'll give you a hint. The gap. I'll give you another hint. Ooh. Our size. U571. Uh, Our submarines. Deploy. <laughs> uh, Those are good hints. Thank you. Future, future weapons. The gap U571. Training command and obligated service. Uh Oh, like military Marines. or something. I'll give you a hint. Blue. Navy, Navy SEALs. Navy. Damn it, that was too good of a hint. Uh, the gap was old because of old Navy. Yeah. Oh those are, those first two hints were real good, Ryan. Right? Those are real good that, trivia hints. That would put me on a whole, totally different path. Yeah, I, was I, was say. I know that was the point. All right, uh. let me find one more really good one. Okay. Look away, look away, Ryan. I gotta look like fuck. <laughs> I'm moving screen and pictures over there. I know, it's yeah, tempting it. to watch. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what this is. Our anime. <laughs> Uh, Earlier, she skipped over Dragon Ball. It would have been perfect. Are you kidding me? <laughs> oh. Well, we're, you were still in the midst of conversation. Okay, here's one. Uh, been here a long time, I think. Uh, Funhouse. God. Moral season starting strong in the if Appalachia. That. Wait, what was that one? Our uh, snowboards. Absolutely enormous wine cap popped out of the mulch overnight. Uh, uh, our gardening. F fermenting. Oh yeah, uh, growing in my mom's flower pot. Just curious of what they are. Couldn't find my Peterson book, or else our mystery cute. flowers, or our green thumb plants, yeah. biology, our fungi, uh, green or mushrooms, botany. What is the study of mushrooms? Is it uh, our mushroomotomy? <laughs> mycology. Oh, I knew it started with my something because of because of, of my mycology? mycelium. That's the only uh, mushroom word I know. Okay, one more, one more. One okay, okay, one more, one, one more. more. For all the marbles. Our marbles. Our marbles. <laughs> Our marbles. <Fuck. laughs> Let's do this one. Okay. Um, multiple armor drop. Solo oh. glitch. Um, solo glitch. Multiple Minecraft. Uh, uh, Our um, Minecraft. Xbox Our. solo public glitch. Modification of hotspot method. Oh, God. It's Our. an online Xbox. On Free Xbox. car repair glitch. Do at own risk. Potentially bannable. Our, GTA? Our, our GTA. G our GTA five. five. Well, our GTA online. GTA online. online. Our GTA online. Did I get it? <laughs> RP glitch. GTA RP. Our San Andreas. GTA. <laughs> our GTA glitches. GTA glitches. Oh, yes. Oh, God. So close. oh. Oh. Anyways, that's, it was right in front of us the whole time. That's my mini. That's Reddit guesser. That was a great G U E S S R. Those are great new That's games. That's a fun game. Um, I'm glad I got really wish you could have looked at it more you without it to, You should have gone to R-U-N-C Online NBA. I would have gotten that. Yeah. <laughs> I went to UNC. Oh. <laughs> no. Uh, thanks for playing. I don't know if the audience you. is into that, but, you know, <laughs> I think it's fun. I was doing it I by myself fun. at home being like, what's this about? And then I would look at the top and be like, oh, weird. <laughs> um, so you can remove this so I can go back to my other little. Oh, there he is. Hey, Omar. How's it going? Good. Hi, the, the game should be guesser, but it's slash R. 
not just R. Ooh, that's good. That's what it's called. G U E S S slash R. Nice, Omar. Nice job. Um, that's it for today's podcast. Uh, thanks everybody for watching. For today's FP. Before we go, I want to show off. Oh my gosh. The oh, McGang yeah. t shirt. Go hard for nuggets. When, when you guys Whoa. are all vaccinated, are you guys going to ride again? We are going to ride and die in that drive through. you kidding me? Oh, my God. Um, this, I believe, is coming out March. Not March. What? April 20th. That's next Tuesday. It's coming out on 420. <laughs> is it really? I'm oh, just, what's that? Hell yeah. Is that, is that on purpose? <laughs> I didn't realize It has that, to be but, on purpose. But definitely. Dude, there it yeah. is. Let's go so hard for these nuggets. I'm glad I got go to become part nuggets. of the McGang because Ryan kept missing uh, meetings. Yeah. I'm, yeah, I'm glad too. And I mean, they needed a fourth. The, the more real the bad. merrier. The more the merrier. <laughs> we the got merrier. you now. Three is not a gang. <laughs> yeah. That much has been determined. Um, any any cool stuff coming out on the channel over the weekend? What do we know? What do we know? What do we got? What, what do we, we know? got? King's gonna, Dilemma, baby, episode got, five. Don't have King's, King's dilemma. dilemma. Things get the wh- second half. Things get things spicy. Kind of go off the rails. Um, <laughs> yes, they in do. some cases, um, they what? definitely go off the rails. If you haven't been following along, please check it out. It's doing really well. Oh God! Um, Raiders is Such happening. Raiders of the Lost Games is 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 kicking off. Y'all killed it on that first episode. That was great. I love. I laughed and laughed. It was very good. Fun. Good. Was great. Um, I'm trying to think what's coming. We have a a tournament coming down the line. Oh. Fishing tournament. Oh, right. but we can, but won't it's say not for a minute though, anymore. Right? We're not. Sure. It's it's something down down the road a yeah. little bit. Couple of weeks, that, maybe. Sure. Hold on, I, your, but that's something to look forward to. <laughs> we went fishing. Um, we Friday did. is a big gameplay that we did. I think Tay was there with us, and John was there. Oh yeah, Attic Edge. That game was fun. Big that was fun very fun. Multiplayer I, game. I, it was I a screamed bunch of us. a lot in that one. Mm-hmm. It Gmod video is out on Rooster Teeth and comes out uh, tomorrow on YouTube. Oh yeah, yeah. Oh I yeah, know. there's Take a new G Mod series. I can't wait to yep. watch that. Uh, so check that out tomorrow, or technically what came out yesterday by the time this video is coming out. And um, yeah, oh, we're sh- oh. oh hi Bender. Um, we're gonna be streaming on Friday. What? Oh gosh, what do we? I'm like, t- what's all the things that we got? Uh, fr- this Friday. For uh, in our normal G-Mod's time slot, I think the first block. Gmod factory, yeah, satisfactory. Gmod is the first block, and then satisfactory. Space stuff. I'll be there. Mm-hmm. Yeah, space stuff. So come hang out with us. Thank you guys for joining me. Of course, in the we're studio a... for the yeah. special set podcast. Uh, thank you, Omar. Thanks, Bender. Um, that's, Felt good to put pants that's on. That's it. Today. Yeah. I, I Anybody have, have anything to say? Anybody? No? Say no that it mm, goodbye. Thank you, we love you all. Podcast. We'll see you next week. Bye. Bye bye.